They broke ground in 1987 and we opened as a National Civil Rights Museum in 1991. A lot of visitors, don't you? We do. We do. We had uh, about Now there is accountability on our government side of the street to make good on the commitments identified in those amendments to the Constitution. So this really talks about other cities where other things occurred other than just the Deep South. The sanitation workers decided that they were going to walk off the job because they were being treated unfairly. I knew that if they were sitting in, they were really standing up for the best in the American You see where the paint is scratched yes. there? The police took all kinds of pictures of this and he shot out that window. When the shot was fired and Dr. King hit the, the concrete floor here, the police ran from the building there across the street and people who were down below ran up the steps and the, the police were yelling, where the shot come from, where the shot come from? And you see the picture oh, of them pointing I across see. the street. Oh. That's where we get the picture because oh. the police were running this oh. way. Oh. Right, they were pointing up. Dr. King was working on poor people's campaign. Yes. And when he got killed, many of his generals didn't really know whether or not they should continue. Right. You know, but right. they decided ultimately that even though they were shocked and in horror, Dr. King had died and he was the leader of the Poor People's Campaign, that they were going to continue. 